What's up everyone, Takedown here, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be talking about some games that are going to be released in 2023. Now, for this video, there's only going to be four that I'm going to be talking about because there's only four this year that I'm really excited for, so let's get right into it. Up first is going to be Crime Boss Rocky City, and this game is going to be released March 28th. Now this game, looking at the trailer after it was released, it looks like it's going to be a really big game. It looks like it's going to be a lot of fun. It looks like the story is going to be amazing, which is something that I'm always into with these games. And any game that comes out is, if it has a really strong story, it looks like it's going to have my attention throughout the whole game. That's ones that I'm going to be probably purchasing. So this game, the trailer looked insane. The gameplay looks insane. And it has a lot of actors in the game, which is crazy. There's way too many for me to list. And remember, uh, but there's so many actors in this game that it just looks like it's going to be a phenomenal game. And it's definitely going to be one of the first ones that I end up playing once it is released. The next game is going to be Dead Island 2. This one was supposed to release in February 2023. But as of right now, it's going to be releasing April 28th, 2023. This is a game that's been in hopes for for the past 10 years but it turns out that they just kept selling the rights to the game to another company to another company to another company and it never got made it never started production until recently and now it is going to be coming out april 28th and the trailer is still the trailer from about 10 years ago whenever they made the dead island 2 trailer but it still is going to be awesome the concept is going to be basically in i think los angeles and i absolutely loved the dead island video games from the past i loved both of them so this one here being a continuation with new graphics and on the new systems it looks like it's going to be phenomenal and I honestly can't wait. Most zombie games that came out over the past few years I honestly was not a fan of so hopefully this one here stays true to the Dead Island franchise. The only thing that I think rubbed me the wrong way whenever they announced it was this game here as opposed to the previous Dead Island games. Whenever you have a melee weapon it will eventually break and you will lose that item whereas back in the day you can have a really great melee weapon and you can bring it with you and use it throughout the entire game game now unfortunately they eventually will break so that one does suck that little element but the game itself looks like it's going to be awesome the graphics look amazing the gameplay is going to be phenomenal and i absolutely can't wait to dive into this game and play the story because it looks like it's going to be a great one next up is going to be marvel's spider-man 2 this game here as a huge marvel fan I am excited, but also I'm a fan of the Marvel games on the PlayStation 4 and PlayStation 5. I absolutely love them, and this game here is going to be no exception. This game here, I loved the first Spider-Man. I loved Miles Morales. So this one here, having both characters in it and having Venom in the game, I think is going to be insane. I think a lot of people are going to like it, and the game itself is just going to be awesome. So the graphics are so clear on this game, any of the Marvel games in my opinion. The Spider-Man mechanics, the web slinging stuff is just phenomenal in this game. So the new era of Spider-Man games is just going to take off and hopefully this is going to be the last Spider-Man game. Hopefully it continues but this game here I'm really excited for. As of right now there is no specific release date but it is expected to be releasing by the end of 2023 and the last game is another Marvel game and that is Marvel's Wolverine. There's actually going to be a Wolverine standalone video game coming out and I'm really excited for that. Now again, this one does not have a release date, but I've seen the trailer and it looks like it's going to be phenomenal. Just like all of the other Marvel games that I played, I have loved them all, all the ones that came out on the PS4. So I'm really excited for this one to see what is going to be in it, who is going to be some of the villains, and I can't wait to see if there's going to be other characters in it or if it's just going to be you playing as Wolverine. I think this game is going to be phenomenal. But again, this game is going to be coming out after Spider-Man, so it's possible that it's not going to be released until early 2024, but right now there is no estimated time frame for it because Spider-Man 2 is going to be released, it says by the end of 2023, so possibly around November is my uh, guess. 
but for Wolverine, it likely is going to be a few months after that, so it's possible it might not be released in 2023, but hopefully it will if Spider-Man 2 is released early enough, then Wolverine will be released after that, but both these Marvel games look like they're going to be phenomenal. I watched the trailers, and honestly, I can't wait. So comment down below, what is your favorite game that you're looking forward to for 2023, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Please take care. Peace.